It's a fucking nightmare, you bitch! <laughs> What is up guys, it's me the Gaming D and welcome back to another video. This is episode number 3 of the Madden 18 Browns 0-16 Rebuild. Now in this series, if you haven't noticed already, we are rebuilding the Browns and we're, we are doing it in a drastic way. First we went to free agency, we got some great people. If you want to check that out, go back into the first episode and you can check out the whole for, you know, free agency experience. The second episode, we went into the draft and we drafted a bunch of people. Now, I think we did a pretty damn good job. You're looking at the team right now. So, starters, we got everyone here. We have one of the people that we have drafted uh, starting on the offense, and that is the uh, fullback. So, I think that's, that's a good pickup right there. We definitely needed someone in that position. Um, also... <laughs> this season we have Joe Thomas back at the left tackle position so hopefully he does not get hurt again and hopefully we can have a good season all right going on to defense honestly in the last video I was thinking I was like all right so we got you know our free safety that we signed we ended up having him uh, be the starter going into preseason but um, Something happened in the preseason, and I think uh, the two rookies ended up fighting against each other, and one overcame the other. Now, Chancellor ended up, uh, in episode two, he was uh, the starter for the free safeties, but now he's backed up to the backup free safety, which kind of sucks. Um, and then the strong safety, again, he's just a backup. But we got people back onto this team and it's looking great uh last season some people were hurt like um jamie collins he was hurt uh the, let's see we got we are we got a, a rookie starting in the middle linebackers position we got a left outside linebacker rookie in uh the second string position and we have a uh dt that's a rookie so hopefully that's gonna be <laughs> Hopefully, if we're gonna be able to get places, uh, this is obviously the. Um, you no, know, dude, our kicker blows, man. Maybe next season we got to uh, do something with him. But guys, we're going to get into this game against the Steelers in Week One of the regular season, and hopefully, this is gonna be great, guys. So uh, we, we'll see you there. All right, guys, so here we are watching this game. The Steelers ended up getting the ball. I'm sorry you did not see the first couple plays. You didn't see the kickoff and then uh, two plays that they did. But here we go. Here we go. All right, so, so far our defense is doing pretty damn good. I can't believe that they're, they've stopped Le'Veon Bell um, just right there, to be, in my opinion. Uh, <laughs> this team, by default, is not the greatest when it comes to the defensive line. I guess our, you know, CBs are looking looking all right. They would have looked better if we had uh, Malcolm Butler on there, but uh, that man is hard to uh, make happy. All right, here we go. Oh, and sack, and sack. Oh my God, I'm honestly surprised. I'm surprised that they just sacked. Big Ben. Big Ben's normally good when it comes to uh, moving in the pocket, but he did not move at all, as you can see on this replay. Uh, that was not good whatsoever. Look, oh my god. I'm, I'm disappointed in Big Ben. <laughs> I'm disappointed in that man. So, uh, let's see what we can do on the, uh, the punt. Alright, so they just punted it, and sadly, we are starting on the 5 yard line this this offense better step it up now we did get a new quarterback for this season and i am happy to say it is kirk cousins <laughs> he did not resign with the uh redskins he decided to make his way down to cleveland now hopefully in my like i want to say hopefully this is predicting the future now in my i think I think this is, they're going to run the ball here to the Garrett Blunt. Yes. Oh, and uh, stopped him. He stopped him. 
let's see, are they going to be doing a four verticals here? They might be. Kirk Cousins, no. And Cousins got safety. No. Oh, my God. His first passing play on this team, and it was a safety. I think I know what we got to do, guys, in the next draft. That, uh, that offensive line needs to step it up. All right, come on, guys. We're going to see here. Uh, they might be running it again. They might be running it to the right side. And uh, I told you. <laughs> um, I'm pulling a pump. I'm pulling a uh, Tony Romo right now. He's commentating. Uh, this is... Uh, it's, it's weird. <laughs> right. Big Ben is throwing it. Oh, he was almost intercepted. He was almost intercepted. Oh, man. You were so close. Oh, man. I can't believe that. Look at this. Oh, that was right into your hands. Dude, he came back right on that ball so quick. That sounded weird, but he was <laughs> he was close to getting a sack on that play. Are they going to be running it? Yes, they are. Oh, Le'Veon. That's the Le'Veon we're scared to see. Oh, no. That was an amazing run. Why? Why? Well, what was that, like a 30-yard touchdown? And he, oh no, they're not running it again. That's a good thing. Oh, they threw the ball. He caught it and then dropped it. Oh my God, guys! You can probably hear me like rubbing my face in like shock. How in the world? Duh. He had it in his hand. Great, great. Got the first down. All right, boys, you need to hurry up, get down that field, score. Uh, but also, you need to come on, come on. Yes, Robinson again catching that ball. I think Robinson might be the number one wide receiver on this team this season. Uh, so far, two plays back to back, looking great, getting them feet in bounds. You can see the little grass pellets, you know, the little rubber. Little rubber pellets. So they're on the goal line here, boys. We are on the goal line. Hopefully they can succeed. Right, they hike the ball. Come on, come on. Oh, Robinson again, man. This man's got like he's got glue gloves. He's got them glue gloves. Third reception. Yeah, I think it's at like 50 yards. Uh, it's it's gonna be close gonna be close to 50 yards it might be running it again just because they're on the goal line base oh they're not what and Robinson with the touchdown what is that four passes got it you know cousins 100th passing touchdown Dude, amazing amazing drive you guys did amazing other than that drop from the tight end Robinson and cousins are gonna be the stars of this team these guys they need to stop the Steelers on this play right here uh, it just gives us the advantage going into halftime but uh, and he did not Bryant bringing it down to the 21 yard line on the other side of the field and they called another timeout oh they're going for the three they're going to work for the three on second and goal with six seconds and they have a timeout this makes no sense guys all right so they're most likely going into halftime 12 to 7 it's gonna hike the ball he's not gonna run it and right to Robinson amazing that was an amazing route running you know play man and they're gonna quickly get back into into the lineup get this uh, playoff they might be running again yes they are oh blunt what are you doing blunt's hurt the Garrett blunt is hurt what we did but around third and nine come on just throw it don't run it oh throws the ball intercepted oh Kirk Cousins threw an interception on the first drive back from halftime this game might not end good, guys. 
Oh my god, I can't believe he threw an interception. He should have just either ran with it or threw it out of bounds, and Bryant caught the ball. Oh my god, that would have been a big help. And Bell is running the ball. Oh, he stumbles. Oh, first down, but Bell is hurt. Bell is hurt, you guys. Something happened to Bell. One more time, guys. And they do. Yes. Yes. And we're going to be going into the fourth quarter. 12 to 7. All right. And they're going to be kicking a field goal to make it 15 7. So if we do get another touchdown. Oh, and the field goal was blocked. It was blocked. Oh my god, that was a big, big upset right there. I can't believe that they just blocked the field goal. Oh my lord. J I think that was Jason McCourty. Dude. Thank you. Thank you so much. Throw that ball. Throw it. Oh my god. <laughs> he was intercepted again. I am hoping they run it. No, and they do not. Oh, and they get stopped. Jesse James gets stopped. So they are going to have to settle for a field goal. All right, man. Try to block this thing again. Let's see what they can do here. Oh, and no block. No block. So now, 2 minutes and 57 seconds left of the game. We are losing 15-7. Cousins takes the ball. Backs up a little bit more. Oh, and he Johnson Johnson with the break oh my god that was the biggest play of the day possibly either him or Robinson with the biggest plays of the of the game for it right now they are going for this let's see if we can get this if not we do lose this game and oh no he fumbled he fumbled no Throws it to Johnson. They got to hurry up this play. They, they're going to have to be doing this and spiking it until the time runs out. Throws the ball and it's intercepted and it's a pick six. That is the end of the game, you guys. Kirk Cousins is not doing great as a Cleveland Brown. All right, they're going for it. They're going to go balls to the walls because why not? Because why not? And they throw it, and it's intercepted once again from a deflection. All right, guys, that is the end of the game as we know it. The Steelers, they are going to knee the ball right here. And the Steelers beat the Cleveland Browns first game of the 2018 season. 22 to 7. All right, guys. So this is the end of the game. The Steelers won 22 to 7. The Browns defense did put up a strong effort, but the offense, I feel like, did not. Especially at the quarterback position. Kirk Cousins, you are a disappointment to me right now. 11 completions, 21 attempts for 142 yards, one touchdown, four interceptions. Longest pass was 29 yards. He did not do great. Now let's go to the rushing. Uh, LeGarrette Blunt, uh, six attempts, 10 yards. Uh, he got injured. So we're going to have to see what his injury is in a second. Uh, we got uh, Duke Johnson, one, one rush attempt, one yard. Um, we got Kirk Cousins, one rush, negative one yards with one fumble. Oh, my God. This <laughs> this is not great. Receiving. Now, this is this was decent. Uh, Allen Robinson, five uh, receptions, 76 yards, one touchdown. Uh, I think that was pr a pretty damn good. He did good. Uh, Duke Johnson, again, he did great. Uh, mostly in the receiving side, uh, three receptions, 46 yards. Um, Blunt, one reception, 10 yards. Coleman, one reception, five yards. Uh, and Joku, one reception, uh, five yards. Now, we can't see blocking for some reason, but defense, 
Uh, our rookie core is, are in the top two. We got uh, our rookie middle linebacker with eight tackles, two assists with a total of ten uh, tackles. And then our rookie free safety with three tackles, four assists with a total of um, seven tackles. And then, uh, yeah, <laughs> not not bad, not bad at all. Uh, let's see who got the most sacks. Uh, he only got one sack. Uh, a left end. <laughs> Kicking, terrible. Punting, terrible. Uh, like, I'm disappointed in the team. And uh, in the next episode, you guys are going to be seeing the results of the 2018 season to see how these guys have played so far now i hope you guys did enjoy seeing this game uh we're gonna do another game like this when it comes to the next season so i hope you guys did enjoy please leave a like comment and subscribe if you have not and i will see you guys in my next video peace